Hey everyone, it's Ivan, Kipatcher.com, out here for another gear review, and today I'm talking about this right here, which is the Whole Enchilada by Dullboy Blades. So what is the Whole Enchilada, and who is Dullboy Blades? Well, we'll get to the Whole Enchilada in a minute, and a little backstory on Dullboy Blades. They are a knife company out of Texas, and in addition to, like, live blades, they also make other stuff like g10 tools we'll say these made out of three eighths inch three eighths inch g10 and yeah basically cut out hand finished and kydex sheaths vacuum formed out of i want to say 0.08 kydex and also no metallic they actually come with a little piece of metallic on there for kind of loose legal reasons. And this right here, I believe is their mini beekeeper. It is a G10 version of one of their live blades, but it is a gentleman out of Texas who's been making knives full time for like three years or so and makes a number of different knives as well as some different G10 tools and the whole enchilada. So what is the whole enchilada? It's a knife sharpener. I will say I like the name, I grew up hearing that phrase all the time, the whole enchilada, meaning like all of it. And it is a, there's their logo, comes a little sticker. And it is basically a all of it, all in one knife sharpener and self-contained. So minimalist, lightweight, you can put it anywhere. And this piece will slide out, flips over, slides back clicks in and then this piece right here is where we sharpen our knives we have a i want to say 600 grit diamond stone and then it comes out flips over and we have a leather strop and underneath there's secret stash area so we have these two different things available to us to sharpen a knife and the whole thing is basically building up rather than out so while you're sharpening it all I'll touch up a knife in a second, but you can basically hold it here, keeping your hand away from the blade, which is nice on a different level. So right here again is the unit set up to actually use. On this side is a notch, on that side it's open. So we can push it out, flip it over, click it in, and now you can travel with it, throw it in your bag, whatever you need to do. To use it, again, notch side, pushing out, comes out, flip it over, clicks into place, and now we either have this diamond stone or our strop or our secret compartment. And right here, I have my Quayback by J. Kovac Knives. There, the internet can come alive with like, hey, here's how you sharpen knives, whatever, I don't care whether you're gonna drag it, push it, little circles. At the end of the day, if your knife gets sharp, like, cool, you're doing it. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this diamond to put just kind of a burr on it. Yeah. And something to keep in mind also, there is a strop, so we use the strop a little bit, but sharpness is relative to the task. So am I gonna shave with this knife? I'm not. Do I need it razor sharp? Not really, but strops are pretty cool. It's getting really sharp actually. It is sharp. I don't know if it's quite shaving sharp yet, but we are definitely getting there. I think this thing, it's pretty cool. It's pretty clever. It's super compact. I think dimensionally it's 3.6 inches by 1.6 by I think 0.75. And then when you actually have it out, it jumps up to a whole like one and a half inches or just over just under maybe 
and weight wise 2.2 ounces everything here whether it's the filament the cowhide strop all that us made packaged everything like that except for the diamond stone i want to say is actually comes from china i'm not sure if we have stateside places manufacturing diamond stones now that i think about it but overall it's just a really cool small design and it gives you kind of enough to do whatever you need and again we get back to the idea of sharp and like what sharp is totally relative to the task in that if you're using a blade to do camp chores and you use that strop and get it razor sharp not super conducive usually to those camp chores unless your camp chores are like sliced tomatoes but this lets you quickly get a blade going for like some pretty rough cutting tasks but then if you're like hey like i actually need a really fine blade for what i'm doing now or a fine edge rather you can just very easily flip this thing over and get after it with a strop with the compound on there and yeah you can hone this thing razor sharp if you really want to if you're interested in the whole enchilada whether it's to bring into the backcountry hunting maybe touch up your blade when you're processing out game or whether it's in toolbox glove box around the house whatever it is being able to maintain a blade is pretty important so there'll be links for this guy down below and you can of course go check out all of the other things he has over there at Dollboy Blades and yeah see what they have to offer but as always thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com look forward to seeing you next time